Da 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 Wait, what's that? Oh my gosh, what's happening to my arm? Feels like... It feels like... What's going on everyone? Today we are customizing Bumblebee Movie Wheel Jack into tracks. Um, yeah, this should be interesting, shouldn't it? I'm, I'm interested to see how this goes, but I think it'll look really, really good. So without further ado, let me show you the colors. So we are using Tamiya X4. Then we're going to be using Tamiya X8, Tamiya X7 and Tamiya X2, and finally, Tamiya X10. So these are the colors that you're gonna need. You don't have to use Tamiya, but if you want the same look that I'm using, then that's what I used. So yeah, but if you do want one of these once I'm finished, it will be available on my website. But I think I, think I wanna clip these off, and the head's not terribly off to what Trax has. They both have this visor, but I'm going to try to exaggerate uh, that as much as possible, sort of sand the sides down to really make his head um, boxy instead of circular, which is, you know, helpful. Um, so yeah, let's, let's get right into it. So to prep this guy for paint, I actually already did a little bit of this for the intro, uh, but Let's uh, let's go ahead and sand him down. But I guess m I should say this is most of my progress is going to be while I am live. Um, you know, I, w I don't want to bore you with a time lapse. So let's just. And here we go. Um, yeah, I just put primer on and painted the white. Oh, gosh. Uh. Yeah, so I've just done that. Not much in the grand scheme of things, but you know what? It's it's fine. I think it's gonna turn out really good. I got the paint to work out of my airbrush. Why does this cover the? Oh, but yeah. So the neck. What? Hey. So not sure why that clip was upside down. Uh, but the next step is painting the blue because I've already masked everything off. That was lots of fun. Um, the arms probably won't be getting blue. Maybe they will right here, but we'll see. Uh, I still have to figure out a way to make wheels go on there. But, yeah. So, that's where I'm at right now.
so here are the parts all drying or dry so oh wow my hands are blue uh so now what we're gonna do is we are going to um do these in a clear coat just to make sure they don't chip or anything while we're trying to paint or move around other parts so let's get to that right now but actually first we need to clean the airbrush because that takes priority over anything so i'm going to show you how to do it all right so now you're going to want to throw your mask right back on because we're going to do the uh this this we're going to make sure this doesn't chip this stuff it dries within minutes um but we're gonna want to turn this on and i'm just gonna do a time lapse all right so the next step we're just gonna remove all of this masking tape when i say all of this masking tape i really mean all of this masking tape because it's there's a ton so boom, there we go. That is that all done. And then we're gonna take the second one and and there we go. So that's pretty much everything that I masked off. I think outside of here with the, uh, the tires. We can go ahead and take that. Actually, we're not gonna take those off yet. That's gonna be like one of the last steps we do. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Everything looks really, really good. I'm loving this shade of blue. It's not like, it's not a perfect match to tracks. It's actually a little bit darker, but this was a very uh, cartoony sort of blue and this is more of a movie blue because everything's darker in the movies i mean look at almost every single michael bay transformer all right so i put them back together and now he's in car mode the other thing i did was i painted this yellow it didn't really go on too well so i'm gonna try it a little different something tomorrow um but i think the car mode looks really good I'm still trying to figure out a way to integrate the blaster on the, the vehicle mode. But I think, honestly, if it just sits there, it's fine. Like, you're... Okay, never mind. Dang it. But yeah, I'm going to work on him a lot more tomorrow. Uh, today was a busy day. All I did was the blue. Wish I did a little more, but, you know, he's still looking pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. But yeah. All right, it's the morning. And I asked my dad and he said that we're gonna drill a hole in this thing. Um, so yeah, let's do it, I guess, you know. Um, I hate to say it, but what could possibly go wrong? All right, so I'm feeling ready to paint again. We're gonna be doing the red on the uh, alt mode right now. We're basically just gonna be focusing on the alt mode for now, but we're gonna be using the Tamiya X7, I believe. X7, yep. And we're going to be doing some red. All right, so I finished the red. Oh, dude, that, that, that's not terrible. It's gonna be a fucking touch in there, of course, but what can you do about this? You know, and then we bring this down. Dude, dude, that looks so good. Okay, why do I okay, can see it now? You can see that this track has just a tiny little bit of red. That's so boring. It just looks like a, like a blue, bright little red, plain mist, but then paint. All right, this looks a whole other. So I think I'm going to touch a few more areas um, with it, but man, that looks really, really nice. I'm really happy with that. Putting these back on. Dude, this is, this is going to be a good one, man. This is going to be a good one. All right, so we've made a ton of progress. We've done the gunmetal. We did some yellows. We did some reds. We did some whites. We did the head, which, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, so now I'm trying to figure out, do I want to have wheels on his arms or on his shoulders? Now, we can't glue them on because of the way he converts, but we can have them sort of Velcroed on. Um, and that would, that would look good. Uh, it would definitely work in his favor. 
Um, but right now I'm just trying to figure out how I can get these off because this, this is a junk figure, right? And I think these wheels would genuinely fit perfect. Um, so yeah, let's let's give this a try. Oh, oh call the blind. Embarrassing. <laughs> like this right here yeah that 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 works okay this is this is gonna this is gonna happen we're gonna do this oh there goes the wheel boom here it is okay that actually wasn't bad at all some transformers on purpose for parts is uh it's not the first thing you see every day that's for sure but yeah now we've got some wheels so these are that's what it's gonna look like so i'm gonna get these on and show you guys what it looks like done you can see i did the velcro there and dude it's actually looking Really nice. Let's uh, let's go ahead and slap the head on. Is it dry? Yeah, it's dry. Let's slap the head on and, dude, dude, look at them. That's tracks. If I've ever seen them. And let's put them next to his G1 counterpart. I think his feet need to be black, and I need to paint the crotch blue so let's just or how about this ah nope well bam yeah i definitely forgot to do the transition uh yeah i messed up on a few parts so i'm just gonna fix that ta-da he's he's fixed up here's how i did it made some massive progress once again on stream i had to i'm sorry i, I just keep doing this off camera I, I i try but you know but here's a good look at him i think he's looking really really nice added some uh copper details dry brushing weathering um some other stuff just to try to mute those really really bright colors still gonna try to do that for the middle color even though i do like it popping i think it looks good when it pops out um it draws attention which is good which is really good to have a custom draw attention to itself all right so taking a look at him and man i think this guy turned out really great a few things i would change here and there but to be honest with you i'm really happy with how he was looking in the middle of the custom i was sort of like not think he was going to look good, but now that he's finished and he's done, he looks fantastic, man. Not to blow my own trumpet or anything, but I think I did a pretty good job with this one. But you guys let me know what you think down in the comments, but let's do a little montage.